Very, very interesting. Well, let's talk about getting and finding support in within this sector. Um, we have, you know, two of our uh, fundraising professional organizations, Association of Fundraising Professionals and CFRE, Certified Funding, Certified Fundraising Executives. They split the word fundraising. Um, you know, I wonder, Tony, and my question to you is like, is the is this when you're a fundraiser are these the people that you need to be talking to about this within the sector because are the folks within your organization that might not really understand what it means to be a professional fundraiser mm -hmm. are they going to be able to give you peer support or do we need to look outside to other fundraising professionals yeah, I think that that's a, a really good question. I don't think there's a one size fits all solution when we talk about our anxieties and, and the things that trigger our anxiety or, you know, or our, our stressors. I certainly agree that folks that are kind of living in the same space day after day will have a deeper uh, insight into some of what you may be feeling. Uh, if, in fact, your anxiety is really driven by some of the work, uh, the way in which you're doing the work, uh, some of the obstacles uh, that, that you may be confronted with. So, yes, I think organizations like AFP and connecting with other folks that are in the same space, mm -hmm. uh, you will certainly get a deeper insight uh, if, if that anxiety and some of the stressors around your wellness are job related. Um, but I think there are many other avenues, you know, as as well uh, to take a look at. And, and some of what I wanted to talk about, because when we think about physical wellness or mental wellness, it's how do we create those wellness opportunities for our team members, again, without compromising our our bottom line. And I say compromising, just meaning that for a yeah. lot of organizations, there just usually isn't a line item. Uh, for these types of investments, although we can definitely attest to uh, the huge ROI that <laughs> that you get when you do invest in the physical and mental well-being, you know, of your team members.